travelers, Todd Michelle here with Traveling Around Disney. And we have made our way over to Riverside because we have heard Boatwright's boat. Dining Hall has made There's some major menu, <laughs> have made some major menu changes, <laughs> boat passing us by. And we're going to go see if the menu changes are a trick or a treat. So come along. Aye, right, let's go board and see what they have to offer. <laughs> come along. So here at Riverside, they have a whole new Tiana collection. The sundress, the mugs, the skirt. Then you come over to the beignet section. All the, the measuring cups. Look at those measuring cups. Yeah, we saw so, those over. I have not seen those. Were I saw those. Are they over at the French Corner? Yeah. Okay. But this. I haven't seen the roller. Yeah. That's cute. That. Wait, is that hollow? No, ceramic. Yeah. It's glass. Okay. And then this. They got the ears. I want you to look at that. That's cute. That is a cute little purse. And the with sweater. The sweater. That's the back right there. They got How much is that little. sweater? That sweater is $44.99. It's not bad for a little sweater. But check the jacket out. Oh no, that looks cool. Almost there. That is fantastic. And then a backpack, a purse, and a clutch. Great collection. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, that's cute. Oh my goodness. Oh they my even gosh. Got a little hand. That's cute. Oh my gosh. This is the best themed merchandise. Travelers, we have made our way into Boatwright's Dining Hall, and that is the, the reason we're here is because we've heard there's been some major changes to their menu, and right off the bat, I already see a couple changes that we're going to have to go over and see what we're going to have for dinner tonight. So they still have the, like the, French, appetizers the French onion soup, right. but they've made it a little different. They've said that their French onion soup is a little different, so we're going to see how that is. And then they went to the... They have the boudin balls. Right, the boudin balls, which we always Versus get. Mardi Gras fritters. Yeah. We and the Amelia we've had salads, those. which yeah. we had last time. Well. Right. Very the Amelia salad's really good. So that's all the same. Yeah. But they changed the recipe, they said, on the French onion soup. Yeah. So I'm we're going to see. I knew that. Come on. There's no longer a captain's platter. It is called now called the Taste of the Bayou. It's an all you care to and enjoy it says, platter. All you care to enjoy. That is $36, and that's what I'm going to enjoy tonight. And then they have the Louisiana seafood boil, which is new to them. It's a low country seafood. Oh, low, I thought that's, oh my God, I cannot see. This lighting is terrible. <laughs> 
and then they they changed their prom rib. It is now a blackened prom rib. So that's going to be the and teller. And it comes oh. with um, Cajun butter. Oh, okay. So we love their and prom that rib prom before. Rib was so good. Yeah. I'm going to try it. Yeah. So I hope it's the same. We're going to take a look at the menu and see what we can come up for dinner tonight. It's not off with their heads. <laughs> yeah. That's good. She waited 45 years to say that. So as we peruse the menu, we're going to see what we can get on board with. Like that. We'll just don't be um, patchy about it. Very nice. I hope I'm not allergic to those. Um, also <laughs> on the um, chicken platter that they had, it is now um, rice and beans that comes with that as a side. So um, there's just been a couple changes in things on the... I heard the train's coming back soon. It is coming back soon. They are already testing. Um, I may have to, you never know, transfer over. You never know. How it's been on them. I know. Look at that. I wish these had, they had to look sure like that. Make sure they can So um, you're going to go with, you made your decision on your appetizer. What are you going to go with? No plant-based tonight. That will be French onion soup for her. Yes. And I am going with the boudin balls, like of my, my favorites. You know, plant-based. It takes me a while. <laughs> it takes me a while. Um, but on fall. But on fall. <laughs> she is going to go with the blackened prime rib, yeah. and I hope it's not as black as coal. More. Oh. oh. <laughs> God. <laughs> and I am going to go with the tour of... The bayou, and really the only thing that has changed on there is the chicken. It's no longer a Louisiana hot chicken, but it is a hot chicken, and they said they've kicked it up a notch because before, the other really wasn't yeah, warm. It wasn't yeah, hot. so that is our appetizers. They did bring out the best cornbread and butter in the world. The best sweet tea. They have the best sweet tea. House-made cornbread with honey butter. And the honey butter is in a Mickey shape. Our Mickey's a little off tonight, but we're going to enjoy these. So um, we've placed our order. We're pretty <laughs> excited. Got to bring in all the props. <laughs> You're some kind of lady. Was that the tea party? Was that in New York? Oh, no, that was in Boston. Yeah. Oh, well. um, it is Oktoberfest. Don't forget. <laughs> the last couple days of October, so we're celebrating. <laughs> Some cornbread. Yes, please. You want the end? Uh, yeah, I'm an end. I like the ends. How big of a piece? Is that big? Yeah, that's good. We always cut it thin, like it's, there's somebody yeah. else at the table. And I got a question. On your loaves of bread, just like this, cornbread and thing. Is this the end? Is this the heel? Or is this the butt of the bread? No, I don't think I have. I don't think you have. <laughs> yeah. So let us know in the comments. It's, it's a heel. Or an end. I call it the heel. I don't care what you call it. Just eat it. Well, I'm going to have this butter right here. This is not a beer cheese spread. This is a honey spread. Cheers, honey. <laughs> Cheers. God bless shine America. Your, shine your light shine on that. Light. Shine your light. <laughs> I literally just made a mess. They might have some of the best cornbread on property. Maybe Trails in. I'm not sure. <clears throat> But this one is nice and sweet. It's not too dry. It's just right. Doesn't crumble too bad. But it's that honey hot. butter puts it over the top. Mm -hmm. That's really good. You can definitely, this is a. It makes me want to have a big pot of like pinto beans. Yeah. This needs its own spotlight. Mm -hmm. This is great. And you know what? They don't charge you for it. What? Nice ears. They don't charge you for it. You know, it's like their breakfast. Oh, yeah. Basket. This is brought complimentary. Which, you know, is unusual, really. Right, because at some places you have to pay for Maybe the bread service. Nice. Here it's complimentary. Mm -hmm. 
Also look at the back of the menu because there are some specialty drinks and they've added a new one. It's called the Big Easy. And I cannot see what's in that. Um, Maker's Mark bourbon, lemon juice, and pure cane sugar with a float of Best Parker Big Easy Red Blend. Man. For $15.50. That sounds quite tasty. No, and I would not be able to drink that. But make sure you check the back of the menu. My little Mike Wazowski's. Uh -huh. <laughs> look, look like little Mike Wazowski's. <laughs> kind of do. They did. Oh, do you want wine first? Yeah. Okay, the appetizers have arrived. <laughs> this is Michelle's French onion soup. I do not see any steam coming off of this, so it might not be the hot bowl enough. Bowl is for, hot, okay. but sometimes that doesn't. Change That's anything. good. And this recipe has been tweaked a little bit from what we understand. And then I got my little um, Mike Wazowski's, the boudin balls right there, which I love. Is it which boudin? is it's boudin. B -O -U -D -I -N. boudin. 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 Well, I'm just listening to the guy that used to be on PBS channel. Is that how he says it? Yeah, boom damn ball. That's what he used to say. You mean the Louisiana guy? Yeah, the Louisiana hot sauce. Not? The Cajun guy? The Cajun, the old guy that used to wear oh the overalls. Oh my God, um, we used to watch all the time. God, all the time. Justin, Justin Wilson. Justin Wilson. Oh, <laughs> So, I think he said boudin balls. Michelle's going to try her French onion soup. I'm going to show you the inside. I of also couldn't understand half his words. That's true. I couldn't either. And I could never cook like he did. But that's the inside right there. The mm. meat and the rice and all that good stuff right Those there. Those are delicious. So, I still need to do something with my hair. I'm not looking good. My favorite appetizer here. Even Leona. Adam Leota. She, she's now. the one in the crystal ball. Yes. Leota. Leota. Right? I was wrong. I thought it was Leona. Yeah, it's Leota. Leota. Okay. Fun fact. A little tad trivia here for you. Uh, Memento Mori. I should have worn this one with the Haunted Mansion. You should have, but it's okay. I, was I think to... we need to see the Haunted Mansion one again. Okay, we'll see it one more time. You want it now? Yes. Okay, so my tad trivia tip is Memento Mori at the Magic Kingdom. Does anyone know what Memento Mori means? I did. What does it mean? It's till death to his part or something like it's that. It's payment upon death. Oh, yeah. That's what that means. So, yeah. yes. So, that's what it means. I got gotcha. you. Michelle, Michelle's gonna try her French onion. See if it's changed. See if it's the best on property. Wait, we'll see. I gotta get... Can't be hard. Four hours later. I have to get down to the broth. Uh, uh, just gotta get to the broth. Good? It's actually pretty good. Is yes, it really? It is good. I don't notice a difference though. No? They just said that they tweaked the recipe, but I'm not sure what that meant. Um, I think they put a little bit more cheese, maybe. Okay. And it it's not as watery as I remember. Yeah, it's a little more a little bit more beefy, like oniony. That's good. Yeah, it's a good flavor though. I enjoy it. Okay. Still not my beloved Steakhouse 71. Mm. Maybe one day on. that'll come back. We need to go back in for lunch okay. and check on that. We will do that. Or dinner. We need to go a little later. Yeah. I would agree with you there. Not people early. People have told me that maybe the dinner, because it's aged, sat, you know. I could see that. Maybe I could it see tastes that. different. So I need to try to get it dinner. Because that still is my number one favorite. Okay. Mm. It's good, right? Yeah, it's really good. But I don't really notice like a change. It's very deep in the base. Mm -hmm. Lots of onions. Mm -hmm. I mean, look, there's like tons of onions. A ton of cheese on that. Travelers are entrees have arrived, and they look fantastic. Um, Michelle, you want to show me a brown rib? It might be hot, hot, hot. <laughs> Come on. It's one thing to sit here and have everybody else that's been sitting with us, but it's fine. But there's a new big family that just joined the vicinity. Yeah. That makes it a little interesting. 
Alright, here's mine. Okay, and so this is the black and palm <laughs> rib and it has a Cajun butter now, um, green beans and mashed potatoes. You can ask this just to be served regular, not blackened, so just remember that. Yama. So, yama. <laughs> that looks like that could defall, you know, that's hot, that's gonna be nice and spicy. I was trying to go with a defalling joke there, but it didn't work. <laughs> Michelle has come a long way, folks. She has come a long way in life. Taste of the bayou. We've got barbecue ribs, taking mashed potatoes, slowest green time. beans, um, macaroni and cheese right there. This is the hot chicken. It's not a wet, it's more of the spice right there. We got some andouille sausage, Cajun corn, and barbecue brisket right there. It so smells wonderful as it's totally it, is, it looks and smells wonderful. Now, I did ask Christy on this. Um, this you cannot share. Once you share it, it is no longer an all you care to enjoy. And if then you- let your plate stop. <laughs> yeah, plate stop. And if you happen to get a reorder on something, you cannot take the leftovers with you. Meaning that if you're on your first plate and you don't eat it all, you can take right, it with exactly. you. Right, exactly. But once so. you order a reorder, they really don't like you to take the food out of the restaurant, so yes. they, they won't let you do that. Which may, which is quite yeah, fair. Yeah, makes sense. Okay, I'm just not looking okay. that way. You just get some butter on that. I want you to taste this on your own. Here, well, you no, no, no. You try one here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna slice him off a little wedge. A little wedge. Because this was one of Michelle's favorite prime ribs on property. All right, try that one. Too, okay, so. I will try that one. Okay, I'm gonna get a little butter on there. There we go. That's my bite. I know it looks horrible, but we're gonna try. Here we go. Cheers, yeah. honey. <laughs> mm. That is good. That's good. That's really good flavor. And that blackened is not like overly blackened. Adds a great flavor. And the it's not butter. overly Cajun. Yeah. It's got a little. Spice flavor, but not really. Cute. No, no, so not it's a bit. Really good. It's not really a bit. good. Yeah. Um, do you want to try Still the, one of my favorites. The hot chicken. Not really. No. no? Yes. Yeah. It's awesome. really good. Right. Yeah. How about a rib? Um, oh, yeah, I'll try. Wait, it. I can't let you try. If I let you try it, I can't get it extra. Oh yeah. Dang. No more. Sorry. I'll give you a little bite of the barbecue. Dang, now we gotta follow the rules. All right, well, just save me a bite, and then when you're done, I'll try. Just take that little bite right there. Ain't no we'll make sure you can eat the plate. No, I'm not gonna, not gonna break the rules. Okay, okay, we'll do that. that but it looks that's really a, good. That's a good thing because I will probably get here. I'll try the ribs <laughs> right there, nice and barbecue. Oh, just watch. Look, somebody's looking at you over there. Look over there. Those are really good. <laughs> Got a nice spice with that barbecue sauce. <coughs> it looks I will like save it. you some more because I will get reorders on these. I can tell you that right now. So I'll save her some. Just wait till you're done eating. As long as you're not going to take any more. Exactly. We can do it that way. So. Works for me. Okay. We're going to go on. <laughs> I'm going to try this hot chicken. I'm really, and it's more of like a chicken strip. And you know, I'm not too much of a spicy guy. So we're going to see right here. That's really good. She did say you could get the prime rib, not black either. So you, you can't get it like it was before. Uh -oh. That's hot. Oh no. Oh. That's that that's hot. To me. To me. I'm not a hot person. She said it was spicy. That right there will the fall of the iceberg. Is your Yeti malfunction? Yes. Ooh, yeah, I'm not, that Yeti quit working. So they did kick the chicken up. It is no longer a honey chicken, Louisiana hot, whatever you want to call it. That chicken is all spicy. I'm going to try some macaroni and cheese, try to get that heat out of my mouth. Mm. Macaroni and cheese, I've always liked theirs. So, okay. So we're going to go on and enjoy our dinners, the prime rib. 
I'm, I'm so, so glad they didn't ruin yeah. that. Yeah. Me too. I think it's a so, good addition. Your ears, your ears. I know you gotta like. You gotta pull it down tighter. Pull it right down tight. I can't. I can't yeah. get a hold of it. Travelers, it is golden hour. We are getting ready to get our desserts. Um, we're going with Christy, our server's recommendation. We are going with the Bananas Foster Bread Pudding, and you know us in bread pudding. It better be a good one. She said they used to serve it in a mason jar, but I don't remember. No, that was the banana pudding. Right. This oh, is a bread, bread pudding. pudding. Oh. Yeah. And we are going with the Vanilla Bean Cheesecake. Which is different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's got a pecan crumble, probably some caramel in there too, so... She recommended that, and we're just waiting for that to what come. That, and um, I have to show you this because I don't think they do this anymore, do they? What? The, the back of my hat? No, they do not. I have to like show you. Michelle got these. Uh -huh. That's Daisy. <laughs> and if anybody remembers VMK, that was her character in VMK. Her, she was Daisy. Yeah, I got lucky enough because I started right at the beginning. My character's name is Daisy. And it's hard to get people that do the hat monogramming to put any character's names on the back. But Daisy, at that time, wasn't a big hit. So that's how she got Daisy. stay in the back and pound it with a rock. <laughs> do you want to show them your dessert? Yes. Because it looks I'm fantastic. I'm going to take I don't lose them. Yes. It's like a little... Um, Skillet. Skillet. <laughs> Travelers, we are going to try the banana bread, the, the bananas foster bread pudding that was recommended to us first. And it comes with the vanilla bean ice cream and a banana and caramel sauce on it. Here we go. This is a new item, new dessert item. Here we go. <laughs> got a baby, baby spoon. Cheers. Cheers. Wait, it's dripping. That's not bad. The rum, I think it's like a rum caramel sauce. Yeah, you can definitely taste the rum. Oh man, that's really good. That's better than their old bread pudding. It is. Yeah, I will have to say that is really good. Nice and warm. I enjoy that. Yeah. It does have a little hit of the rum. I can't hear myself. It does have a little hit of the, the rum. Clean your ears out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna have to find out what kind of sauce that is. Because you can definitely taste the alcohol in there. To me, you can. Banana foster. True. Okay. You know, like. Yeah, you know, that like, makes sense. I have to By the way, travelers, in. if you don't mind hitting that subscribe button down below to become a fellow traveler and to follow along with us, you never know what we're going to come up with and where we're going to be. We love meeting new travelers, having dinner with travelers, lunch, breakfast. Not too early. We don't get up too early. I don't anyway. Um, yes, so, you do. Yeah. So make sure you hit that subscribe and the notification bell. Please. And a big thumbs up <laughs> if you don't mind. So we got one more dessert share to go. Share the videos. Yeah, share. Share, share, share the Please videos. share to people that you think will like them. I mean, who wouldn't want to see that right there? <laughs> I tell you. She is a trooper. Let's try the cheesecake. Okay. This will be it right here. There is a pecan griddle on here. Ooh. Ooh, it's got a nice cut to that cheesecake. Right there is that no, bite. All the bread. Caramel <laughs> sauce. No, there's another piece right there. Here we go. Let's give this a try. That is good. It's really good. Very I'm good. Happy. Very happy. Both desserts were great. The platter was good. Honestly, I probably would have went with Michelle's prom rib. Because I thought that prime oh, was fantastic. Good. We'll come back to And that. I can't even eat it all. Yeah. I'm, I took the rest home. Yeah. The, so was this a trick or a treat? This was a treat. This was, was a treat a through and through. From the appetizers to the entrees to the dessert. Everything has been great. We hope you guys have enjoyed our little Halloween special, weekend special. Um, hope you've had a great weekend. And travelers, like we always say, until next time, travel and adventure is out there. <laughs> Okay, travelers, we just ran into some fellow travelers from South Carolina, Blake, <laughs> Heidi, and Maddie, and it is Maddie's birthday and yeah. first time at Walt Disney World. You guys having a great time? Wow, yeah. great. Yeah. Awesome. Too. Well, it awesome. is so nice to meet you guys and have a fantastic time while you're here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy, enjoy. Well, hello, travelers. <laughs> Wait.
Wait. Okay. And we're gonna go see if the menu changes are a trick or a treat. So come along. Come aboard. What was I supposed to say? Come along and let's see what Boat Rights has to offer us. You still didn't tell me what I was supposed to say. House-made cornbread with honey butter. <laughs> I don't know. I spazzed out. That was almost smell. a shortcake. Can you smell that? Oh my gosh. Well, I can never wear the bands. This looks like a kid size. <laughs> you know, like it's... <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Wait, I'm so chill. Yeah. Yeah. I think I need to get my hair done. You think that's your biggest problem? <laughs> what is this supposed to be? That's not. That's uh, Madame Leota. Is it Leona? Uh, Leona? Did I say Leota? Leona. I don't know. Look it up. So, um, I still think I need to do something with my hair. That's your French onion soup. I don't know. I think I've tried it. <laughs> I'm such a distraction. I haven't eaten in many years. 